Jason, we spoke after the win against Cardiff. How satisfying was this one against Swansea? Yeah, it was um, extremely satisfying. You know, we we knew how good they were. They're a good team. They're very aggressive, front foot, come and press. They came and had a go, you know, and um, credit to them, they made it really tough for us. But I think um, we showed our quality in, in the end with, and we managed to score two good goals and we've seen it out. What did you make of uh, Aaron Connolly's performance, particularly with the two goals? Yeah, it was great. And it's great for him to get two goals as well, you know. And um, you know what strikers are like. They, they love scoring goals. It's, it's a great confidence booster for him and hopefully he can um, take that over the next, next few weeks and get some goals in, in the league. Important for some of these players that haven't had much game time. And how nice was it to see Tarek Lamptey back? It must have been difficult. Yeah. You guys know what it's like for him, yeah. the hard work that he's put in over the last uh, few months. You know what? You, you just you couldn't be happier for somebody, honestly. And um, everybody in our in our squad and our club has got so much love for him. He's, he's just such a such a great lad, a, a great great person as well. And if anybody deserves to come back, and by the way, he was good, wasn't he? And, mm. and he looked like he had never been away. So if anybody deserves, we've seen how hard he's worked, the ups, the downs, you know, he's had some tough times and he's come out the other side and fingers crossed he'll be ready to play in the, in the Premier League soon for us because he's a massive, massive ass, asset. Opportunities for him and an opportunity for Jürgen Nakadi who's come back to the club yeah. as well. Yeah, that was great. It was great to see Jürgen back out there. I think he said um, that was his first game for a little while there, since June or something like that. So he's obviously uh, felt that early doors because it was a quite sharp quick pace game and um, but it was great to see him you know and he showed some real quality um, in particular I can remember throwing it to him and thinking oh I've stitched him a little bit there and he, he's spun out of it and, and we got through and yeah he's, he's got without doubt massive quality. Last time when you played against Cardiff you had a young defence in front of you you had slightly different personnel mm. this time but still equally as good. Yeah equally as solid you know I, I said to Ed before the game, I said just, just to enjoy and savour every moment because this doesn't come around again. You know, your, your first team debut. Um, and after the game, I said to him, make sure you find your mum and dad and give them a wave. And, and you know, they, they should be really proud of him. And hopefully, this is the start. Like I said last time, they've, they've had a taste now, the young lads, and it's it's got to it's got to be a start for them to kick on and and want more. Yeah. Obviously, progress in this, more game time for you as well, and and. Keeping that winning feeling going, I suppose. Yeah, it's massive, company. massive for confidence. You know, the the lads that played on Saturday didn't play tonight, but still, to have that winning mentality and that feeling in the dressing room is massive. I said that before. It's it doesn't matter who plays in our squad. We back each other to the hilt. We're, we've got a great unity. Um, don't get me wrong. At times of season, we'll 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 have to struggle and we'll, we'll find it tough, but I guarantee we'll stick together and and we'll come through the other side of it.